Alright buddies, welcome back to more of Death Stranding. Been really an awesome game guys and I got nothing but pleasant words to say up to this point. So thank you guys for all the supporting this series. All the likes have been really great, I appreciate it. And with that being said guys, I won't be taking much of this intro. Let's play this.
Where are you? No idea. I'm seeing tanks and soldiers. The uniforms date back over a century. World War II era, I suspect. Uh, did you see the man leading the soldiers? No. I think it's the guy you told us about. The born and bred warrior asshole who's gunning for BB. He must be our ticket home, right? Don't ask me. This is only my second time. And without BB, he'll be hard to find. Lucky for you, I've got BB here in tip-top shape, just waiting for you. Where should we meet? Is there anything unusual or distinct near you? I'm in the sewers. Hang on. I can see a tower through a hole. A square tower, right above my position. Gotcha. I'll find it and search for a sewer entrance. Can you sit tight for now? Gladly. I won't move an inch. Yeah, well, if I'm slow, you might have to. What? That warrior asshole. He wasn't after me. He was after BB. <sighs> Fuck me. Right. If he's looking for anyone, it's you. Oh, no. Hurry the hell up, Sam. Keep it together. I'm on my way. And don't hook up BB either. We'll lead him straight to you. Oh, boy. Not that you would, since you hate them. I just did because I was scared to death. Disconnect. Now. Uh, already done. Don't let him take BB. How? If he shows up with his soldiers, what do you expect me to do? Fight back? If I have to choose between BB and myself, well... <sighs> you won't. I'm ending the call. Sam. It's not easy being me. No wife, no children, no friends. And so I sought solace. Sought company in the dead. Over time, I made them a part of me. 70% of who I am today. But meeting you has opened my eyes. You're very special, Sam. All right, buddies, here we go. <laughs> As expected. Um, the only problem right now, we don't have any lethal weapon. Oh, shit. Wait a minute, bud. They've got a bullet gun. Let's keep scouting them. Hold on, buddy. Oh, we got a lot of stuff over there. Mm, shit, man. Really not cool now. I can't fight back, but since... You see, I don't have the little weapons here. Wait a minute, but... Let me run then. Easy now, buddy. I think we got a grenade. Not bad. Gotta keep it running, man. Oh shit! What the hell? What did just happen, man? It's really not cool now. Problem is, I don't have any worms. Come on, man. What the? Is that really necessary, man? I think I should be running then. I'm not hearing any here. Okay, finally. A worm. Finally, man. Found you, bud. Let me eat some. There we go. Let me eat more. I think that's it. Let me pick another one. Now, where are you, dead man? Oh, nice. Wait a minute, bud. Where's my next destination? This one is, uh... Oh, it's just somewhere here. Gotta need to find a tunnel, right? I think I should be heading down somewhere here, man. Hold on, but... He might be just below this way. Hold on, but let me just take the smoke grenade first. Oh, just try to load this tunnel. Let me go this way, then. Come on, dead man. Where are you now? Oh shit, he's not here. So it kinda seems like I need to head down to this tunnel. But at least there's no time limit, but. <laughs> oh shit! Okay. What it just happened? Let me just grab the smoke grenade first. 
Switching between auto deck functions, Hollow Bird. Use for to switch the auto deck into spotlight mode. Okay. All right. Here it is, but the light will shine in whatever direction the camera has been pointing out. And I run in here. Gotta seem like we can't. Easy now. Controlling the camera in tight spaces. Okay, we got a compass mode. I think it's not been really useful in here. So the only thing we need to do is to find dead man. In which might be the mysterious man already found him since the BB is with him. The problem is that he started to connect with the BB. In which I guess it activates something that the veteran soldier has been detected that a BB is somewhere inside this uh, area right now. Anyways, well, buddy, if you're watching this video up to this point, thank you, buddy, so much for watching, man. It just really means a lot to me. Let's just get further here, bud. Gotta be like a battle awaits for us here. Am I safe to go down? Okay. Nice. Alright, I'm hearing the BB right now. Easy, but Hold on, buddy. Let me pick some. Where is he now? I'm not seeing him, man. Let me just pick the schematic grenade then. Oh shit! Hold on, but I'm not seeing him. Oh, I think I need to go up in here. Where are you, Chunk? This might be the one. should be working again. Uh, let me see. Oh. Oh, well then. <laughs> Maybe this is a special beach for soldiers who died in battle. Maybe we should get the hell out of here. Yes. I'm surprised. I thought you would have abandoned BB by now. <laughs> Discard precious hardware? Never. Uh. So, do you still share memories? <sighs> I see. here. Seems like I got other memories to tend to. I'm taking him down as you get us both out of here. Uh, you know, Sam, I'm starting to understand why BB is so important to you. Huh? It's just a tool. Life and death are supposed to be irrelevant. But we've got attached to each other all the same, haven't we? <sighs> Kid's not just a tool. Name's Lou. Lou, huh? That's a good name. Oh. Oh. All right, um, join dead man. We're done in that part, so I think I need to grab this ladder then. So if I'm going to choose the name of the BB here, I would rather choose it under my name. <laughs> Hold on, bud. I need some... Hold on, buddy. Why can't... Wait a minute, bud. 
Color gun generator. Uh, let me have this one. We can supposed to use some spotlight here, right? Okay. Let me just carry some of these blood bags then. I just really hope I can find some metal weapons here. Since pretty sure we had a battle awaits for us. Oh, not here, man. Oh shit, that was a whale. Damn it, buddy. You already detected me. Uh, Alright, we got a assault rifle here. Nice. I battled me this. Wait a minute, bud. What is that stuff? There we go. An armor plate over there. Kinda seems like I'm about to use the one right now. Use this one, bud. Oh shit! They're getting many right now! Gotcha, bud. I think we got him. Oh, still alive! So if I remember correctly, I need to defeat him four times. Alright, we got him. Now what? What is next in here? Blood draining, anti bd ammunition. Wait a minute, bud. Okay. What about this stuff? Got a shotgun over there. Wait a minute, bud. Let me just check first my cargo. Let me offload all of this. And gotta be putting up this blood bags. Yep, I think we're good now. Confirm. Where are you, bud? Well, I have a great feeling that this Clifford one, his name is Clifford, right? Clifford Unger is, uh, has been a part of the BB. That's why he's been really attached to the BB right now. In which he was trying to, you know, he was trying his best to claim it back for him. Let me just go this way. Kinda seems like the voice coming from here. <laughs> but at the same time, it's so creepy, but I don't know why. I think I should be getting this shotgun then. Where's my BB? See? Where's my BB? Maybe get if I would be just, you know, handle the BB myself to him. <laughs> right? It was his BB after all. Let me pick some. There you are. Tango, tango. Got the other one. Oh, you chump. Oh, shit. What the hell? Got your butt. Got him. Oh 
my god, another one. What's with the bell, man? I'm out of venom right now. Damn. Let me just pick all of this first. Alright, nice. Gotta eat some worm. Man, I better need more rifle in here. I'm not ready for this, that's why I didn't bring a lot of little weapons. Wait a minute, bud. I got a shotgun, right? Where's the shotgun? Okay, it's here. I think we're good now. Let me just uh, pick this one up first. Anything else in here? There's that armor plate over there. Let me have one then. Okay. Looks like it found me already. Just right behind me, I guess. Where is it now? Where are they, by the way? I'm not seeing them. Oh shit, there they are. Fuck yeah. Party chunk. Show yourself, motherfucker. Gotcha, but. Right. Nice. Anyone else? Armor plate. Oh shit, a grenade. Get out of the way. Where is it now? Man, battling this guy is more harder compared to battling some beaties here. Gotta have been really difficult, man. Okay, there's an armor plate over there. Let me just take this one first. Hold on, but there we go. Um, let me just attach this to my suit. Hold on, bud. Oh, it's just an armor plate, not a skeleton one. So I think. Hold on, bud. Right shoulder? I think no need, man. No need for now. I'm okay with this. Disengage. Disengage. I think I should be switching to this shotgun for now. I'm just right here. Okay, we got an assault rifle. Nice. Where are you, Chunk? Show yourself, but not seeing him. So it kind of seems like he's just inside this. Uh, is this a church or what? Kind of seems like a church, man. Yep, it's a church. Never just get inside, then, because I believe they're just right here, roaming around this chapel. Show yourself, but light him up. I think they saw me already. I'm not seeing them. Man, honestly, man, they're really hard to find. Oh shit! There he is. Check yourself, but. To hide. So he runs too, huh? Oh shit, there he is. Got him. That's the third one. So 
So I'm thinking that it might be the cause of the beatings in here since they are these powers, man. That's what I noticed. It kind of seems like it's been the root all of this uh, things have been going on in here. Wait a minute, but let me. Oh shit! I got a ball at time. I'll just change first to this. Uh, wait a minute, bud. Here we go. Since we got a level two in here. Where is he now? Let me just try to go outside. Hold on, but. Okay, we got another blood bag here. Wait a minute, buddy. Might have a lot of used blood back here, so let me just offload all of this. There you go. I uh, gotta be pu gotta be putting all of this one too, placing it to my utility pouch. All right, nice. Not bad. I'm just right here, but just gotta be waiting for you for me to get out of this place. Trying to show up. Got a first one. Got another one here. Oh shit, there it is. Oh my god! They're right beside me! Luckily, just in time, I turned myself. Nice, we got it. There you are. This will be the fourth one once I kill this guy. I hope this will be the last one. Here we got him. Nice. Alright, uh, we got our souls right now. Client has been dead, man. Um, escaped the battlefield. Nice. Total damage taken by Sam. Okay. 2,669 ml. Alright, data acquired. BB completed. Okay. I got an A rating. Should have been an S, right? <laughs> Anyways, not bad though.
Hello. Lou. How's little Lou doing? No response. <laughs> well, look at that. The child's taking a shine to me. <sighs> you two were out cold, so I had you brought here. You were right. Whatever you did back there returned us to our own world. I put your cargo and gear in your private box. You slept for a whole day, you know. Slept like the dead. <laughs> I'm already back in Capital Knot. Fragile's beach has been coming in handy. <laughs> Sam, I owe you an apology. Lou was the name you were going to give your own baby if he'd had made it. I should have pieced it together sooner. Don't know what you're talking about. I found some records from ten years ago. A death, sudden, in the middle of a town. Young woman in the prime of her life. Nobody knew until it was too late. A void out. Her husband, who was a member of Bridges, had dooms. He tried, but he couldn't get to her in time. The whole town was wiped off the map, leaving nothing but a big crater and him. Because he was a repatriate. People wanted answers. Did the man hide his wife's body on purpose? The only survivor was the only suspect. He was easy to blame, and people did. And pretty soon, they were blaming Bridges, too. The man felt responsible, so he left. And his wife, who died, her name was Lucy. She'd been pregnant, poor woman. They were going to name their son, Lou. Didn't happen. But it did. President Strand told me. She talked about you all the time. He didn't have to cut all ties and walk away, she said. You want to shut the fuck up? Calm down, Sam. Take a seat. I told you before about my body. 70% harvested from cadavers. Do you want to know the real reason why? Because the story you've heard is one I made up. The truth is, I'm Frankenstein's monster. Artificial, grown from pluripotent stem cells. And when that vital spark didn't manifest in all my organs, they replaced the defective ones with those of the dead. I never had a birthday. I'm a soulless, meat puppet. No car, a dead man. People born the traditional way have beaches. You have one, BB too. But I have no such connections. No mother, no afterlife, no beach. You see now why I'm so obsessed with it all? Why I joined Bridges? The battlefield. Now that was an awful beach. But strangely, I didn't hate it. Because I knew you were coming for me. I've never felt that before. Connected to someone, anyone. You didn't have to cut all ties and walk away. The president was right about that much. It wasn't anything to walk away from. It's not like I was ever welcome there. Come on. Even I was welcome. Oh, that. You were holding it. It's an old dog tag. U.S. issue. Wasn't easy prying it out of your hand. Clifford Unger, as you can see. I looked him up in our database. Found a match. He was U.S. Army Special Forces. Fought in Kosovo, Iraq, Afghanistan. That's him. 
Well, that's all I've managed to dig up so far. You must be caked in chiral matter from the battlefield. Time for a shower, I'd say. Oh, I won't be joining you this time. The Die Hardman issue is no longer a concern. I've seen to it that our conversations won't be recorded. Oh my god, man. Kinda seems like the store has been heading to heading to be more interesting right now. Holland Bud kinda seems like he's pointing to the sink. He wanted to go to the sink right now. At least we got a BB here. Check on Lou. Now he got a name, man. Not just a BB. Here we go, bud. It's been a while since I soothed you, man. Gotta give this a try. But well, it kind of seems like he didn't notice me. So wait a minute, buddy. Let me just uh, take a drink here first. Wait a minute, buddy. Let me have a bite of this worm. Looks like I better need more of this. Look at this man. Look how they eat some of these worms here. <laughs> oh my god, look at my figurines here. Wait a minute, bud. It's been a while since I checked my figurines. Examine figures, not a figurines. My bad. Look at this. I got planner right now, and this is the. Wait a minute, bud. Nightmares and memories. Revisit. Okay, I can go to the battlefield. Okay. Maybe sometime in my spare time, I will try that one. What a nice collection it is. So, here's what I'm going to do now, bud. Looks like a battle need a shower, but for the one, gotta be checking some of the stuffs in here, which I haven't done for quite some time. That's a magic grenade. Um, what about this? We got a shotgun here. Look at this. We got some nice weapon here, man. The riot shotgun. Well, I can't zoom it in for this. Uh, Rifles, I don't know why. Got a sticker gun here. Not that much. I think we're good now. So let me check first my backpack. Maybe you can customize an additional utility pouch, right? Hold on, but here we go. Equipment. I already put up uh, around six slots for my grenade pouch. One extra slot for my extra battery. Hold on, but stabilizer. Wait a minute, but. Ah, stabilizers. They help you stay upright if you stumble. When you attempt to regain your balance, they automatically engage their attitude control system to provide assistance. And if that isn't enough to stop you falling over, they'll reduce the impact for you and your cargo. Alright. Kinda seems like this is really important, so let me have this one. Confirm. But, wait a minute, bud. So kinda seems like I can't put the one. Wait a minute, buddy. Extra battery will increase the amount of battery available for active skeletons and other equipments. Man, this could be really useful, but it will cost me my six slots of grenade patch. Anyways, let me just uh, switch this one to the love nut. There you go. Let me confirm. I prefer the grenade patch rather than that um, stabilizer. So here we go. Let me use the sink first. Gotta take one shot here. Let us see if BB will like the one. Hold on, buddy. There you go. 24 likes from Lou. Nice. So from now on, I'll be starting to call him Lou instead of just being a BB, right? 
Here we go, bud. Let's gotta take a shower then. Sam, do you copy? As you might have suspected, time here stopped while you two were on that battlefield. If my thinking is correct, the dimension to which you traveled is a kind of beach. Uh, um, to, to explain a little, our bodies, our ha, all occupy the same world. But our souls, our ka, have beaches all their own. These beaches are given form inside our brains by our beliefs, religion, philosophy, and so forth. As a result, a beach can be anything, and those anythings form a multiverse. However, if many people die at once, their beaches can become entangled, creating a strand field. This phenomenon is exacerbated in wartime by omnipresent feelings of resentment and despair. Beaches are more easily and frequently entangled. On such a beach, exits vanish, and experiences cycle endlessly. Um, picture it like a, a, a record player. The needle skips, playing the same phrase again and again. They're fighting a battle that has no beginning or end. Round and round it goes. Now, the battlefield you visited was in Eastern Europe in World War II. Hmm. Which is strange, given that the man you encountered, uh, Clifford Unger, played no part in that conflict. I can't explain it. But if you can connect me to the Chiral Network, who knows what we might discover. EX Grenade number zero. Alright, nice. Your bunch of EX grenade number zero right now. Not been really using it. Still there, Sam? If so, I have a request. When you're ready, head upstairs to the delivery terminal. Sure thing. So before I'm heading towards outside, let me just check for the terminal here. Gotta check up some mails. We got five mails here. That would be proud, okay. I was right about the camera, but I'm told the pictures I took were incredible. Okay. Connections keep us alive. It's coming from the doctor. Well, pretty sure, but I'll be reading all of this uh, away from recording. But if you want to read this one, you can pause it somewhere here. The mountaineer, watch out for the white out. Hey, Sam, I hope this gets through to you. The way I took a turn for worse a little while ago, and now it's gone full, full white out. Okay. You got a boy, and they have power gloves. Big news, Sam. We're just welcoming new life into the world. Baby boy. Both him and the Miss Us are doing fine. In fact, they're sleeping peacefully next to me as I write this message. I know you're a busy man though, so I won't go on and on about us. Anyways. Recovery requests, dead man stuff. Party butter you Sam, I know you must be busy. I just wonder if this will be appearing in my mission cargo requests, mission delivery requests, rather than just appearing to my, you know, standard orders. So before I'm closing this one, let me just check first my bridge links here. So just when I thought I already reached 100,000 likes, a little more, but 99,000 likes here. And wait a minute, bud. How much time did I play? Around 36 hours and 36 minutes already. That was pretty awesome. Almost two days already, man. Look at this total distance ascended. Total distance descended. Total time breath held for. <laughs> I'm not really holding my breath, man, since each time I encounter some BDs, I want to fight them instead of just hiding out. Total distance traveled, 260 kilometers. Wait a minute, bud. How much likes did I get in here? So from other players, I already get 52,000 likes. Not bad, though. Anyways, bud, kind of seems like I'm about to save the game now. Here we go, bud. So buddy, I guess that's all for this part for now. I'm gonna continue the next destinations, deliveries in the next part of the series. So, for you guys watching this, thank you buddies for all the support. Catch you again next time. You better say some other buddies. I love you. Take it easy, bud. God bless.